Hello everyone, welcome back. So we were waiting for that uh, full image uh, backup to end, and you can see right now when I click on status in the server, it tells me the file backup status is okay, image backup status is okay. That means everything went well, everything is done. Uh, it says online status is okay, and activities is tell you what we so far what we like you know what time did we back up this incremental backups so when we right click and in the client system and backed up this was right here done one minute ago uh, and uh, in the backup for the image is nine minutes ago so, but this right here is 1.82 GB and that's the full system basically it's everything uh, this is just the, that files we specifically pick on the client system that I need this files to be backed up to the server and that's also done if you come here backup you can actually come here and see what backups are done logs uh, statistic it will show you basically what's been used on the client system and everything how much space it's taking so it'll show you like in this way a backup client and then how much it's used and everything okay all right let's go back to the client uh, actually let's go back and see uh, the client information over here that it is, it is really backing up or it's not so you click on that folder where the server is saving the files and you see right here this is the latest file that we just say that uh, my server needs to back up and you can see right here everything on the client side is backed up on the server in this folder and this folder basically will be after five hours in the setting that we define after five hours is going to create another folder and then the same one is going to create more and more and more unless it reaches the maximum limit it will delete these one right here the old one and it will leave the rest in here and images right here this, these are big files now so they're not gonna the server is not going to create uh, another one after like uh, 30 days or 60 days how many days you want the server should take an image of the system okay so this is how you are going to do backups now let's go back and how do you restore this let's say a system has been like you know everything is done your hard disk have so many wires and you want to image the system now how do you do that let's go back to our client right here so basically this client has a wires right now and everything is messed up in this right here but we already took an image and server already got it so what we need to do is go to this computer and we need to download an ISO file which is which can be found on the on the server basically on the site and if you go to the site right now let me show you guys pretty quick so we know exactly what we were talking about go to google your backup click on the first link and go to downloads and then this right here download your backup restore cd and once you click on it it will start downloading the cd so basically i already did the download for the iso it's a big file it's 320 something mb so what i'm going to do i'm going to restart this machine first I'm gonna stop it so I can open a ISO so I went to this client PC and I plugged in my CD and I'm gonna start my computer from the CD you can change this with F9 or you can change it with from your boot system whatever system you're using you should have that system in there to start your computer from a CD or USB you can also do that so you start the system click OK it's gonna look for the CD and this is how it's gonna look okay system setup and it's just gonna go through all right you're back and please ensure that, that the hardest you want to restore data is in your is in your system data on this blah 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 you can just click OK and it's searching for server right now this is the server that we created and the images on this server basically so it's looking for it right now
Alright, so say please select your viewer name and you're gonna click backup client and that's the only one we saved so far so you're gonna see that only right there. If there's more clients you're gonna see more. So we're just gonna click OK. And what do you want to back up? Please select the date which you want to restore your system. And that should be the first one. And that should be right there. It will just warn you that everything will be deleted. Loading MBR. And basically, it's connecting to the server to restore the image. Let's see if that's going to work. So, restoration process the process just started and it's going to be a little slow because basically you're doing everything on internet and it depends on your bandwidth if you have a lot of bandwidth it will be faster or if you have slow bandwidth it's going to be slower then okay at the end you'll see successfully restoring your computer it will be restarted now press ok Gonna say initiating shutdown sequence, pretty cool. Huh? All right, you guys can see the window is back up again. And there you go. Everything is the same. It's the same as imaging. Everything is working. And this is how you back up the whole system. And it looks like it's the easiest and <laughs> very easy way to just copy and back up the client systems. If something happened in case, you can image re-image them from a restore ISO. All right. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully you guys uh, learn something from it or if you guys know better something better than this uh, to share it and do not forget to subscribe to the end of support. Thank you.